Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to learn Spot Healing Brush Tool in Adobe Photoshop. So friends, Spot Healing Brush Tool used to repair, smooth and remove unwanted portion of an image. This versatile tool is surprisingly easy to use and effective when it comes to touching up your images. Now friends, the Spot Healing Brush Tool in Adobe Photoshop is powerful tool for removing a blemish, spot and unwanted object from your image. It works by sampling the pixel around the area you want to remove and then blending them in seamlessly with the surrounding area. Friends, this tool is often used in portrait and beauty retouching to remove acne, scars and other skin imperfections. So friends, the spot healing brush tool is a greater for removing a small object like a power lines, dust packs and other unwanted elements from your image. So friends, you can see the spot healing brush tool in a toolbar over here. By pressing shortcut J, you can activate this tool. Now as you can see, there are more 5 tools in this category. So if you are in other tool and if you want to switch from one tool to another using this J shortcut, so for that you need to press shift plus J so that you can switch from one tool to another. So right now I am selecting spot healing brush tool. So friends in this category you can see spot healing brush tool as well as healing brush tool and both the icons are almost same. So maybe you have a question that what is spot healing brush tool and what is healing brush tool. This healing brush tool we are going to learn in our next video but still for the information I will tell spot healing brush tool is used to remove blemish, marks and a small objects from an image and this healing brush tool is used to repair any imperfection in an image by painting with a sample or pattern. So there is a difference between these two tools. So in the next video we are going to learn this healing brush tool. For now we are focusing on spot healing brush tool. So friends, first of all we are going to check all these options. Okay, But first I am showing you how you can use this spot healing brush tool. So once you select this brush tool, now I am going to this image. Now friends, if you don't want this lamp in your footage. okay. So this is a very easy if you are using a spot healing brush tool. So once you select this spot healing brush tool, you can get this brush over here. So you just need to click like this or you can just drag over the area you want to remove like this. And as you can see that area is removed and also it will be placed by the background. So you can see this is a very beautiful tool to remove the unwanted area and an object from your footage. Like this I can also select this part. Like this I can also select this part. As you can see that lamp is gone from my footage. So friends first of all I am showing you how you can get increase and decrease the size of this tool. So first of all in option bar you can see this brush. Okay, you can see the brush size as well as hardness, how hard the brush is and the spacing. Okay, by changing the size, you can see our brush size is increase and decrease. So these are very easy, just increase and decrease the brush size and you can see the changes like this. So friends, beside this, you can see a mode. There are different mode like a normal, replace, multiply, screen, darken, lighten, color and luminosity. So friends, determining how the new pixels integrate with the original one, the default is a normal. Okay, by default the normal mode is selected. So other option including these all having a unique effect on your image. Now if the current blend mode not produce the desired result, then you can consider switching to another. So by selecting the other modes, you can see what effect in your footage. So friends, beside this, you can see a type. Okay. So first of all, I am just pressing Ctrl Z to undo my changes so that I can show you what happened if I am changing these types. 
So friends, first is content aware. Is the latest addition to the collection and use image analysis to determine the most suitable content to fill the area. So if I'm selecting this lamp with my first type, which is content aware. And as you can see, it will fill with the other area. And friend, next we are going to see proximity match. Now proximity match examine pixel adjust to the circle for the replacement. Now we are going to apply this type on this. So as you can see, after selecting this, this will also gone. So friends, next we are going to see create texture. So create texture generates a pattern based on the surrounding pixel. Generally content aware yield the most satisfactory result. But if it does not meet your expectation, trying one of other types may be worthwhile. So right now I am using this create texture and selecting this lamp. And as you can see, it will be getting a little bit of pixel around it. So these are the three result of content aware, create texture and a proximity match. So these are the three types. Normally we are using a content aware to our spot healing brush tool. So friends, next is sample all layer. So friends, if you check the sample all layer box, then the tool is sample from the background layer. Unchecking the box limit a sampling to the selected layer. In this case, the selected layer is our footage. For example, right now I am creating one more layer and if I am selecting this all sample layer and try to design on this part so as you can see still it is working on our main footage so friends now my sample layer is off okay and now i am creating one more layer and try to drag on this area so friends as you can see nothing is nothing happen because this sample all layer box tool will sample from the background layer okay so there is a use of this sample all layer so friends, now we are going to see some example where we are removing some unwanted object or some part from the footage. So first of all, in this footage using a spot healing brush tool, we are just removing this lamp, just drag and drop on the footage you don't want. Okay, I don't want this lamp on my footage, just selecting this and as you can see, it will gone. So in our next footage, which is this. Now here, I don't want this object on my image. So what I am doing, I'm just selecting my spot healing brush tool and simply drag over this part. Okay. And boom, it will be gone. Okay. So friends like this, you can use a sample healing brush tool to remove a unwanted object from your footage. And this is a very useful tool in Adobe Photoshop. So friend, this is our uh, next example. Okay. Now I don't want this mobile in this image. Okay. So simply I'm using this spot healing brush tool and just drag my brush over this phone. And as you can see, boom, it will be gone from my footage. So this is like a magic. You can't recognize that the phone will be there or not. So friend, this is our next example. As I told you earlier, this tool is often used in portrait and beauty retouching to remove acne, scars and other skin imperfections. So friends, I don't want this black dot on this model. So what I am doing, I'm just selecting this spot healing brush tool. And now if you want to reduce the size of this brush, then simply you can go to here and decrease the size as well as you can also select a bracket okay this bracket to decrease and increase the size fine so i'm just selecting this and just click on the part you don't want i'm just selecting here and as you can see the magic happen so spot healing brush tool is very useful in a portrait and a beauty retouching fine so in our next example we are going to remove some objects so let's see what we can remove okay i'm just selecting my spot healing brush tool and for example i don't want this wall clock in this footage so i'm just uh, increase the size of my brush fine and i'm simply click here or you can just select the part around it okay and boom 
so friends as you can see this tool is very very useful in adobe photoshop to remove the unwanted part from your image so friends like this you can use this spot healing brush tool in a multiple way so friends that's all about a spot healing brush tool in adobe photoshop so overall the spot healing brush tool is a powerful tool that can help you quickly and easily remove a small imperfections and unwanted elements from your photo so friends thank you so much see you in the next video with healing brush tool thank you so much guys